The Hydro Power Project will address power generation and reliability issues in Ley and Aramo Grid as a whole once it is completed. PNG Power Limited Acting Chief Executive Officer Ivan Pakaya says this project will take six to ten years to complete. As you all know, Hydro Power takes three to five years to complete the studies and financing and another three to five years for procurement and construction. So we are talking about six to ten years to have BUSU commission if all things are aligned. PNG Power Limited is ready to work in partnership with the Morobe government and Resource Holdings Limited to complete this project. I'm excited about the BUSU hydropower project and the partnership we are putting together with the Morobe provincial government and the Morobe Resource Holdings Limited. Um, because once developed, it will address power generation and reliability issues, especially in Lay and Ram Grid as a whole. Morobe Governor Luta Wenge welcomed the partnership and assured his full support for the project. In relation to the agreement we were going to sign uh, to enable the project, hydro project, to commence uh, initially with the feasibility study uh, for Bushu. My government is in full support. Without any reservation, we're in full support of our partnership. PNZ Power with the Morbi Provincial Government and the Business Arms Partnership to embark on the study first on the, the potential of Bushu to produce hydropower. We, we, we in full support. Governor Wenge, while pledging his full support, also emphasized the ongoing blackouts in Lay City. He highlights the importance of addressing this issue promptly. In the city of Lay, we have almost two hours power breakout. That that is uh, that seems to be uh, existing culture for Morbi Lay City. Uh, but we are an international city as what must be. So many people will come into Lay and Morbi province to transact in all sorts of matters, business. And power, as you know, I don't need to tell you, power is the one that powers those things. Mr. Pakaya says this is the first memorandum of understanding with Morobe government and they plan to extend this initiative to other provincial governments in the future. We, we have similar arrangements as well. We are looking at partnership with the um, with the provincial governments as well as our you know, pu public-private partnerships that we try to engage in, which we are looking at right now. Um, so this is not the only one. Um, we have many that are being discussed right now and which will probably come to light. May not have the significance of a sign-in and a media like this, but it will do happen. Yeah. This project enables PNG Power Limited to provide electricity support in rural communities in line with the government's policy to connect 70% of households by 2030 and 100% by 2050. Lauren Jamal, National MTV News.